Hey, I'm Andre Boulay for Yo-Yo Expert, and this is the sleeper. So this next trick I'm teaching you here is the foundation of every trick uh, you will go on to learn in yo-yoing. Uh, the yo-yo is spinning here at the end of the string after I threw it, and it will just continue to spin and spin. And this is how we do all of the advanced, intermediate, every trick you see from here. So very much like the gravity pull, um, you are going to make a muscle and very much like the gravity pull, it is just as important to make sure that the string is coming over the top of the yo-yo. If it is coming over the bottom or under the bottom of the yo-yo, uh, it will get stuck to your hand when you go to throw it. So make sure it's coming over the top like so. And again, just like gravity pull, you are going to make a large muscle. So I'm making a large muscle like that. And again, it's this part of your hand that is going to snap out. And you'll see I'm just going to snap it out like that. Um, and the difference here between this and gravity pull is when you snap it out, uh, you are really wanting to literally just snap the top portion of your hand out and stop it. Um, that is huge. So when you throw, it's a quick snap. And the better you snap, the better and stronger the yo-yo is going to sleep. Uh, let me slow down here for you. It's this part here, so it's gonna snap straight out like so. And what you'll also notice versus gravity pull is in gravity pull, as you were coming down, you immediately turned your hand over to catch it back up. And it's a very common problem people have when they throw and they're learning sleeper is that they'll go and they'll turn their hand over. And what it does is it puts a sideways spin on the yo-yo. It's gonna just spin out on me, uh, which is not what you want. So you actually want to make sure you wait to turn your hand over until it's time to catch. So let me show you again real quick. So we're gonna throw straight out like that. The yo-yo is sleeping at the bottom of the string. Then I turn it over and it is a very light tug. And you'll notice too, after I tug, my hand actually remains in pretty much the same station and it's the yo-yo that comes back to it. So I throw, give it a very light tug and that's what's coming back. And again, you do not wanna turn your hand over until it is time to catch. So it's throw straight out. My palm is still face up. I turn it over to catch. That is the sleeper.